Hi guys, so I'm back with another one of my sketching videos. I'm going to say right off the bat that this one didn't turn out quite the way I wanted, but I received a bit of feedback from multiple sources, all very encouraging, and quite a few people have said to hurry up and upload something soon. So I've taken great efforts to rush and make this up before I journey north. I even made the effort to quash my procrastination down to a bare minimum, so I hope you're all proud of me. I managed to look into a bit more about my current YouTube situation. Luckily, all the strikes against my name are apparently not that big of an issue, being that they happened a long time ago, but apparently, while I was gone, YouTube created this fancy new rule, which basically means no one's getting paid until they hit 10k views on all their videos and then they have to apply. I think it was made with the understanding it would help weed out all the smaller bogus channels out there who are ripping off other people's work and uploading it themselves in order to make money off it, but that still doesn't leave me very happy. I had almost gained $1.23 off all my videos. I was quite proud of that. Thankfully though, I still have my Patreon account up, which I'm currently working on. It's not perfect, but I have decided to resurrect it out of the dark and murky grave it had been condemned to from neglect and starvation of attention. Everything is a work in progress and I hope to improve in time. Today, in case you haven't figured it out by now, I'm attempting to create a siren. I figured it would be fitting, given that sirens are generally creatures of vengeance, unleashing havoc on their surroundings, and anyone who knows me at all well will know that I am well and truly a creature of havoc. And also I'm feeling a tad put out by coming back to my channel and discovering these new changes YouTube have made. Sirens are not to be confused with mermaids, just as an FYI. I figured I'd educate you all while I'm here, because I'm seeing a lot of confusion between sirens and merfolk throughout my travels on the internet. Sirens are generally the more dangerous folk. They can come in the form of a bird-human hybrid, a fish-human hybrid, some configuration of both, and some of them are, have been known to shapeshift. They are generally born from acts of injustice, such as women being drowned at sea, someone being unfairly killed, or just generally there to unleash death and suffering because of an act or acts of unfairness that have gone down in the past. Merfolk are a lot more basic. They are basically your fish-human hybrid. They can lure sailors down to their deaths, but they are not stereotypically murderous. Kind of like humans, I guess. They're generally there as dwellers of the ocean, protectors of its kind, and some people reckon they can either come about if a woman dies peacefully who loved the sea, suicides of course are a grey area, or from the more widely accepted rumour, manatees spotted far off by lonely sailors and pirates craving for female company. Manatees can sometimes display some very human-like behaviours, but I do wonder about the eyesight qualities of those who had made that mistake. I should probably finish this up by now, as I am on a very tight time schedule here. But yay, I finally have something to upload. Bye!